I just like, you know, a job that will give me some money. It's tough to argue with that, especially when you're 18 and spending an afternoon on a golf course. How many? All right, I got you down. Tea times have been solid ever since the pandemic, but word of a new battery plant for Tesla just down the road means more divots in this fairway, and they say that's good news. Well, we'll probably get some business from the guys over there at the plant. They're going to get off work and want to come out and hit some balls, you know. Chris says this town is a lot like his golf course. It's a huge hidden secret. And once a business that works with Tesla opens, he says people will come. I mean, we got a McDonald's and a Burger King, and they're building the Taco Bell, that's all we have. Others say the new plant will help grow the schools and the town's economy. It's academics, you know, the whole deal. Increases the tax base. It's definitely a cool thing for this area. In golf terms, the plant is like a three iron from this golf course. And while most of the people we talk to love the idea of potentially 4,000 new jobs coming to this area, some had other concerns about Tesla. The thing that I'm worried about is what are they going to do with all the batteries once those things go? I mean, you know, you got to have a place for those. Still, some golfers say the best thing about a business that works with Tesla, the jobs are probably not going away. Tesla's like the new wave. You see them a lot more on the street. And that means future workers like Brett might be interested in working there. Yeah, probably. In DeSoto, Alan Show, Canby C9 News.